Well, I, as an actress, I've, I've done many ages. In Roots 2, I went from 14 to 36 as Alex Haley's mother. And Sparkle, my first film, Hey, what's I was up and welcome back to my channel. Academy Award singer and actress Irene Cara, 63, was found dead inside her home in Florida. Cara, who is a child performer, entered the national spotlight playing Coco Hernandez in the hit 1980 musical film Fame, which earned her two Grammy wins. In 1984, she went on to win an Oscar and Grammy for the iconic flash dance, What a Feeling. Cara 63, singer of the hit flash dance, What a Feeling, that earned her an Oscar in 1984, was confirmed to have passed away by her publicist, Judith Moose, on Saturday after midnight. It is with profound sadness that on behalf of her family, I announce the passing of Irene Cara, Moose said in a statement. Her cause of death is currently unknown and will be released when the information is available. The post came just after a death hoax about Cara, who starred in fame and sang its theme, with many fans fearing that the latest announcement may be part of another lie. Sorry if this is true, but I'm afraid after the hoax, it's, be, it's difficult to believe, Twitter user Rachel L. wrote in response. She joins the long list of celebrities who have been victimized by previous lies about their death. However, Moose confirmed that Saturday's announcement was real, adding that we are all in shock. Now let's take a look at her humble beginnings. She was born in the Bronx as Irene Escalera. Cara had humble roots. Her mom, Louise, was a cashier, while her father, Gaspar, was a steel worker and a musician. Cara inherited her father's talent, becoming a trained singer, actor and dancer, who made many on stage and television appearances as a child. The performer then rocketed to fame in 1980, playing Coco Hernandez in the hit musical Fame. She received two Grammy nominations for the musical and won Best New Artist and Best Female Pop Vocal Artist. Cara went on to win a Grammy and an Oscar in 1984 with the title track to Flashdance, which starred Jennifer Beals. She fell out of the spotlight after suing her former record company during the 1990s over her earnings. That saw Cara awarded $1.5 million by a California judge in 1993. But she was shunned by the music industry as a result and her career suffered. When confirming Cara's death, Moose wrote, She was a beautifully gifted soul whose legacy will live forever through her music and films. The publicist also expressed sympathy for the performer's fans over the recent death hoax. None of us were ever contacted regarding the lies on a Facebook page. I completely understand it being difficult to believe. We are all in shock. May her soul rest in peace.